the church, the greatest force on earth. For more than 2,000 years, we are here, expanding, establishing, conquering this earth for the kingdom of God. You and I, we are part of something really big. I dare to say, something eternal. Nothing can defeat the church. Nothing can stand against and prevail against. Who said that? Jesus Christ Himself. In Matthew 16, He said clear that all the forces and powers of hell cannot prevail against the church. I love to know that in my life group, I can multiply, I can expand the kingdom of God because I have the promise, I have the word of God. Yes, in all over the earth, we see persecuted countries, Christians being sometimes even killed, Bibles being burned, but the kingdom of God is expanding. Why? Because the end is coming. Jesus said, until all the earth get to know the message of the good news of the kingdom of God, the end won't come. But the end is coming. That's why you and I can go boldly to proclaim and proclaim the good news of salvation. In Revelation chapter 6, that's the text I would like to read for you. Verse 9, John had an amazing vision. He saw what will be before the throne of the Lamb. It says, After this I looked and behold a great multitude that no one could number from every nation, from all tribes and peoples and languages is standing before the throne and before the Lamb, clothed in white robes with palm branches in their hands. Look what they were crying. Crying out loud, salvation belongs to our God who sits on the throne and to the Lamb. This is the message that we will proclaim for eternity. And now you and I can stand in our life groups, in our community, proclaiming what we will proclaim for eternity. Salvation belongs to our God. It's just that. It's simple like that. And when we do that, we are connected supernaturally to this great movement of God all, all around the, the world, proclaiming the gospel, proclaiming the good news, make us part of His church, the greatest force on earth. And you and I, we are into this force. We have this power. We have this anointing. We can multiply because we are the church.